Today, we'll be mounting and balancing a new tire and installing a new TPMS sensor, all with tools that are very affordable. The first thing we'll do is remove the valve stem with a little tool like this. Next we'll be using a Harbor Freight hand tire machine to push the old tire off of the bead. And this is just a little soapy water. It may help and it may not. Do the same on the other side. Now we'll clean up this side of the rim real well so the tire seals. Now we'll take out the old TPMS sensor. And clean up where the new one mounts. And again we're just using some lacquer thinner. We'll be using the CG Sullet TPMS80 and the TS01 for our new sensor. Before we install the new sensor, we have to activate it. So we first put in what kind of car you're working on. We're working on a Chevy Sonic. And that's the year. So, uh, scan program sensor. Say yes. And we're just going to copy by activation and say yes. And this one is going to be the right front. And right now it's programming the sensor. And programming success. And this one has a, a sleeve that threads down. And you just tighten it.
After the tires aired up, we'll throw it on this bubble balancer from Harbor Freight. You'll want to make sure that it's zeroed out before you start. In other words, that bubble has to be right in the middle before you start balancing your tire. And you can adjust that with those screws. And it looks like we're going to need a little bit right there. Right about there. Yeah. Right about there on the F. So they have these little stick-on weights, and we'll just tap it in a certain spot, and it should look the same each time. And I'm just getting it to where that bubble's right in the middle. We'll put three of them there, tap it, and I need a magnifying glass to see perfect. And that, that looks pretty good. Let's try, we'll try it one more time. Maybe right there. That looks a little better. Right on the U. Right in between the F and the U. And we'll mark where we want to put it. We have to transfer this to the back side. Here's our mark, and we're going to clean it up right here. To center it right on that mark. You'll want to torque each lug nut to the correct specifications and you'll skip a lug nut each time. And then we skip this one and go to this one. Last, the car has to learn about this new sensor. So we'll choose position relearn and hit OK. And we're going to do number one, OBD. And clear previous data. Follow these instructions and it says scan each sensor so we'll do that we'll scan the left front first and now we'll scan the rest of them after scanning it says please connect OBD and turn the ignition on and it's writing sensor ID to the ECU. That's the left front. The next one. 
the next one, and the last one, and it's done. and OBD relearn was successful. I hope you enjoyed this video on mounting and balancing your own tires with TPMS sensors. If you did and you'd like to get my latest videos, don't forget to hit the subscribe button.